Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be testing and reviewing the Vita Liberata Luxury Self Tan System. It comes with a 10 minute tan lotion, a body blur, and a bronzer. Holy moly, they work. It's something you've got to see to believe, so get comfortable and hang out with me for a few minutes so you can watch this stuff in action. Let's jump right in. Before I start, I'm going to add the tiniest bit of lotion to my wrists, elbows, knees, anywhere that bends. This will prevent those areas from absorbing too much product and becoming messy. Now we're ready to tan. The Vita Liberata system comes with three products. You're going to start by applying the 10 minute tan with the provided mitt and rub the lotion in really well on your arms, chest, hands, stomach, and legs. Everywhere you can reach. There is a bit of that self tanning odor with this product, but do not worry. We are going to rinse it all off in a little while. Don't forget your face and neck. Can you guys see this stuff working? It really is pretty impressive. Now you're gonna hop into the shower and just rinse your body. Now for my favorite part, the body blur. Take just a bit of this instant HD finish and apply it all over your body. Apply it to your arms, your chest, your stomach, and your legs, and make sure to blend it in really, really well. This is gonna give you the most gorgeous and glowing finish and an extra hint of color as well. Look at the difference between my legs. That is insane. And again, don't forget your face. Obviously, you have to snap a quick selfie for your Insta story. Okay, so I am fully tanned. This has set for a couple of hours now. I thought I would just get the rest of myself ready on camera and chit chat about the system and test out their bronzer, which I'm really excited about because you know I love bronzer. I applied the 10 minute tan to my face and the body blur. The body blur is amazing. I had also moisturized, so I'm just gonna go right into my foundation. So I'm using the Clinique foundation, which I love. I actually think I look like so tan, I don't even need bronzer. But I'm gonna do it anyway because I don't really think there's necessarily any such thing as too tan. Okay, so let's talk about the Vita real quick. Pros, it worked. <laughs> Once you use the first product, you were supposed to let it sit for um, 10 minutes. I probably left it for almost an hour before I rinsed off, which I don't know if that's a faux pas. It said you could go up to 20 minutes, but I don't think waiting longer had any negative effects. Once I rinsed it off, I dried my body completely. Then I applied the body blur. The body blur was incredible. If you ever used Sally Hansen's airbrush legs, which I do a lot, or I did, um, it's like that, but it's lighter. It's so much lighter and it's not as makeup-y. Like, when I put the Sally on, I would feel like I was just putting foundation all over my body. This stuff, at first it felt like that, but once you rubbed it in, it really blended well and gave you that little extra color. Okay, so that's done. I'm gonna set. If you notice, I don't do too many makeup tutorials, like full face, because I honestly just use the same products and do the same thing every time. I like testing things out. That's why I do a lot of like reviews, but I don't know, I feel like overall I'm pretty boring. I'm honestly so happy with this system. I looked so dark. Let's try out the bronzer. That looks like a really, really beautiful shade. I'm actually excited about this. So this is their self-tanning bronzing minerals. I'm gonna apply this to my face and neck and see how, ooh. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, it's giving me like hula vibes. It's giving me those, um, what's the chocolate one? Too Faced vibes. Wow, it's a really nice matte powder. 
It applies so smoothly. Guys, I love this bronzer. I think this might be my new favorite bronzer in life. Um, okay, so back to the system. I know this is this is actually really hard to do your makeup and talk. What I didn't really like was the mitt. This is really random, but the mitt was hard for me to use. I'm not very good at um, using any like applicators. I'd rather just apply the product right to my skin with my hands. Um, so that was kind of annoying because the mitt kept like turning over. I think you totally can just use your hands, but it could get messy. First product that you apply with a mitt um, smells a little self tanny, the 10 minute tan. It does have like a, a bit of a self tanner smell, but not as strong as like a Jergens. Um, but it's okay because you rinse it off. So when I used it, I kind of felt like I had just gotten out of an airbrush tan. If you've ever gotten an airbrush or a spray tan, like a Mystic, it kind of resembled that odor, it was a similar scent, but you got to rinse it off, so. I would recommend the body blur on its own. I'm really bad at talking to you while I do my makeup. I actually give girls a lot of credit now who do this because it's hard. I forgot that I didn't want to do my makeup like this. I'm just like doing what I normally do, but I saw, saw this gorgeous look on a girl um, on Instagram today and I saved it. She had like the most beautiful eye makeup. It was just like a bronzy, just like all bronzy but I don't think she had any liner on so whoops I suck so back to self tanner I had been using a tanning system or a self tanner product for a while um, that I found at Sally's and I loved it actually I didn't find it the girl at Sally's recommended it to me and it was a great recommendation it worked so well um, I got it as a spray. It was like a spray tan, but I found out that they make a mousse version and I actually prefer the mousse just because it's easier to apply and I think it goes on a little more even, but I just featured it in my June. Oh my God, that's what I forgot to put in my thing. Damn. I featured it in my June favorites post um, last week or the beginning of this week. So you can go check that one out, but I'm curious to see how this system works and if I end up really liking it and continuing to use it because it just may replace that one. But it's okay, it's okay to have a lot of uh, tanning products that you love because you're gonna use them. Um, I know I use mine all the time. I use my tan products probably, or well, definitely multiple times a week. I have to go get an oil change today and I feel like I'm gonna be all fancy. I am gonna go under my eye. So yeah, if there are any self tanners that you like swear by, let me know. I know I've shared a few of my favorites in the past, but I literally like to try them all. I'm gonna go over my liner real quick with this e.l.f. That's my new thing is doing my liquid liner, putting my eye makeup on, and then going back over my liquid liner. If I was talented enough to do it, the liquid at the end, I would, but that's risky for me. This is risky enough. Whenever people like compliment my makeup, I it's so nice. I really appreciate. And obviously, I'm sharing makeup on here, but at the end of the day, I'm not that great at makeup. Like, I'll look at some girls' tutorials and I'm like, holy cow, you are so talented, and I'm just like, meh. I really want to take a class. Better yet, are there any makeup artists who want to teach me? Or are there any makeup artists? Ooh, in Connecticut who would want to like come on here and do my makeup and show me how to do it. And uh, we can collaborate. <laughs> Maybe teach me a thing or two. That would be fun. I always feel the need to say this because people will call me out. They'll be like, you're not supposed to do that. That color's too light. This is blah, blah, blah. And I get it. I'm sure there's right and wrong ways to do things, but I just do what I like. I'm not a professional. You don't have to take my advice and my advice might not work for you. That's why YouTube is filled with hundreds of thousands of people creating all different kinds of content. Okay, so real quick, this mascara is called Showing Out Display Your Lashes and I found it at a TJ Maxx. <laughs> really random find, but I love it. I'm gonna top it with my Marc Jacobs. I'm really into mixing and matching mascaras lately. I just find I usually get the best results. Oh, I forgot to bring a blush. I don't film in the same room that I keep all my makeup, just cause it's not, it's not really conducive to filming. It's a little 
tight quarters. I don't really have a good place to put the camera or my light, so I bring it all into this room when I film and sometimes I forget products like my blush. I love this Kylie lip color. I've been using it so much. I love the liner, but I don't love the liquid lipstick that comes with it. I've been eyeing a new lip kit lately, the Nice and Spicy from MAC. I think I would love that. So that's on my wish list. I need to order that. But until then, I still have plenty of Kylie to get me through. I like to top this with something a little more pink. This is a Wet n Wild Balm Stain. Okay, we're almost done. So now I'm just gonna take um, my Nude Wear palette and add a little highlight to my collarbone here. And that is it. My face is made, my tan is set. I am feeling bronzed and beautiful and ready to go about my day. I love this system. I don't say that often, but I really, 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 really liked it. You started with the 10 minute tan, which I told you I left on for probably like 40 minutes or so. And then you rinse it off. Then you apply the body blur, which out of everything in here, this is probably the biggest game changer for me. It just like smooths you out, gives you a little more glow. You can totally use this on its own without the rest of the system. So I like that. This is cool if you just wanna like touch up your legs or your arms, or maybe you're wearing a long dress, but you need to bronze different parts of your, your body. Maybe you're wearing a skirt and you wanna touch up your legs. This is what that's gonna be for. I love it way more than any other instant color I've ever used. I would highly recommend. It's a very thin formula, but it's got great coverage and color. The bronzer, I'm obsessed with. I love this stuff so much. It's probably my new favorite bronzer. Oh my God. It's like such a perk. When I got this package, I didn't really realize there was gonna be a bronzer in it too. So I got a ton of really awesome things. So overall, I am super impressed. I have to thank the Preen Me VIP program for sending this to me. Um, I did not pay for the system, but all the opinions are my own. And thank you Vita Liberata for sending this to me as well. I love it. Very happy, very tan, very ready to go about my day. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little demo review. <laughs> Let me know if you've tried this system before or any other one that you really love in the comments below. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. And oh, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And I will see you next time. Bye.